Good morning, guys. I'm wearing my year of heart set again. I feel like I have been wearing this like crazy lately, but it is the most comfortable set ever. It's 8 a.m. on a Monday morning. I'm about to take the dogs on a walk. I've been recording at noon, and I'm hoping to be able to work out and, and grocery shop and film a Devo before then and walk the dogs. So I guess we'll see. Obviously, look what I mean, as always. I'm using the little heavy energy. Hey! Guys, Fitz had a sleepover in my room last night and it was literally the cutest thing ever. He's such a cuddler, he just like spoons me the whole time and like I literally cry because it's so cute. All right, boy, we're going out. Oh, don't you dare bother her. Coco's a queen, you have to leave her alone. So I'm gonna have this. I don't even have my AirPods. Like, what do I think I'm doing right now? All right, guys. I just worked out. I went on a walk. I worked out. I'm gonna go shower. I was gonna try. I feel so weird right now. <laughs> I was gonna try to go to Trader Joe's, but I forgot I have someone coming to my house between 9 and 11, and I have a recording at noon. So. I'm actually going to get my groceries delivered through Instacart, which I do often. Like, I really like Instacart. I just really felt a Trader Joe's trip coming, and I still need to go because I need to get, like, my basics from Trader Joe's, you know? <sighs> Anyways, I know this sounds, like, so ridiculous, and I I've talked about, like, what I do so many times, so I'm going to stop talking. This is not sponsored, by the way. Um, I literally, I think it has changed my life. I drink so much water. I feel so much better. I'm drinking more water than I've ever had before. And it is just the best thing ever. Like, I'm gonna fill that up again. And yeah, I'll shut up about it because I'm sure it's annoying, but it's really good. I also, you know what? I actually am not sure. I'm pretty sure I have a 25. Sorry for the sweat, but I'm pretty sure I have a 25% off thing. It'll be in the description. Whatever. Anyways, I got this package from Tower 28, which I saw on everyone's Instagram stories this past weekend, but I haven't unpacked all my boxes from the past week because I was gone, so they're just kind of sitting in my den. So are these lip glosses or blushes? These stickers are cute, guys. I want to come out with stickers. The alternative milk of lip gloss. Guys, you you know me and lip gloss. It's everything you love about a juicy lip gloss with none of the hang-ups. Okay, so I'm going to try on this one right now and see how I like it. Ooh, I like the finish. I wish it was like a little bit thicker, but if you want like a thin lip gloss, this is really good. Also, that stuff on top of my fridge is driving me insane. I'll try it later when I actually get ready for today, too, and tell you guys like how I really like it. Another thing that I got is this fridge organization egg holder, okay? It was probably the most unnecessary of all of the fridge organization that I got, but I actually think that I might do a TikTok of my fridge tour with everything that I have in here because um, I have a lot of organization stuff. I need to throw some stuff away, though from this past week just that we haven't ended up eating. So, I feel like I bring leftovers home, but like lately I just haven't been eating leftovers at all. Even like leftovers of things that I cook. Oh my gosh, guys, I also make a really bomb strawberry shortcake from home. Oh, my Dyson fell again. Guys, okay, how many times is this gonna happen with love? And yes, I know I have a holder. I just haven't had that installed yet. Okay, so, Anyways, yeah, I just feel like I have too much stuff right now. I have cool whip. Like, since when do I ever have cool whip, you know? Also, a question. When I'm vlogging and posting, like, daily, do you guys want the vlogs to be shorter? Because I know, like, a 30-minute vlog every day is, like, a commitment. So do you guys want them to be shorter or what? Because I feel like I just love having a vlog where it really feels like you guys are with me. It's not heavily edited. It feels like we're actually hanging out for the day. But I totally understand if I'm posting too much and they're too long. Um, if you guys can just let me know, or if I'm posting too much, or whatever you guys want to see, let me know. But like, I'm really on this like vlogging kick where I'm posting like five times a week at this point because I'm just like really on one. So like, I'm wearing a propeller. I'm gonna take you guys with me as I online virtual grocery shop. Basically, I never do this. I take you guys to Trader Joe's and I show you a haul. But right now, I just I don't know. I've been I normally. Normally at the beginning of the week, I make like my menu for the week. I sometimes will do this on my iPad, like I'm really extra, but I really just need to get like a notebook. I always normally just do it on the notes on my phone, but I'll go on normally like the Modern Proper. That's my favorite place to find recipes. I actually want to start doing it from my like legit cookbooks over there and like not just having them as decor and using them for recipes. But right now, nothing sounds good and I can't even like, 
I don't know, it's not that I don't want to cook, it's just that like nothing I see sounds good. So I'm gonna get like my basics of things that I, are just my go-to's for now, and then I'll probably go to Trader Joe's when I'm like, okay, I'm ready to cook. I'm gonna get a Rayo's pasta sauce just because you always gotta have that on deck. Always, I always get bananas, garlic, salmon. The thing with my Instacart, everything that I'm doing right now looks like it's a deal, um, is that it just kind of shows me what I've already um, like gotten before. Onion, always avocados, bread right now, so I don't need that. Kale, broccoli, I eat broccoli so often. Um, I have been so weird, like I can't really drink iced coffee right now, I, even though I got stuff to make my own gold brew, it's just the weirdest thing. Love Chobani, always need lemons. I guess I could do like maybe two apples, but like literally, it's so weird, nothing sounds good. I can make a caprese salad, that would be good to keep in there. Okay guys, we're, I literally have to be stopped. It's just, why can't I just bring it into the room where it doesn't fall, you know? Instead I just keep doing that. But I get white cheddar cheese it. I'm not going to, but. I love having chickpeas on deck, garbanzo beans, whatever you call them. And I know that I'm eating out tonight. I'll probably eat out this afternoon because we're going to do stuff today. And so I just like don't really know what I need to get for the week. So I'm just gonna stock up on the basics. So I got rails, marinara sauce, bananas, garlic, salmon filet, onions, Avocado, kale, broccoli, Giovanni Greek yogurt, lemons, apples, mozzarella balls, uh, cherry tomatoes, coconut almond milk, garbanzo beans, goldfish, and cucumber. What I'm getting, I guess I just showed you my haul already, but I'm gonna have that delivered and this is gonna save me some time this morning. It only cost me like six dollars basically to have this delivered and to me that's worth it I'm like sure why not so I basically just got all of the basics that I normally tend to grab and then not stuff that I'm like going to cook this week because for some reason I just can't and like it feels like fall so you'd think that I'd be like all about soups right now but like in this moment in time, I just can't even think about food. So we're getting the basics, okay? All right, guys, I just got ready for the day. Um, after I get some work done and record and stuff, I think Q and I are gonna go somewhere. I think we're going to Trinity Groves, um, it's maybe a museum, something that's good for like social distancing, but we're gonna go do something. Um, I changed into my outfit and I actually really like it. I need to go through my closet right now because I hate everything that I have and I need to get rid of it. So. This is just an Aritzia like TNA top that I just kind of tucked in, which I like the look of. These jeans are BDG. I've had them for the longest time. I love how like flattering they are around the waist. They like definitely make my butt look really flat, but that's fine. Um, and they're really cute. And then I'm just wearing my black cowboy boots from Free People. I'll see if I can link them. I always link all my outfits on my Like to Know It profile. So download that app. I link literally everything that I own. I have new jewelry from Tala Rose LA. I really like their stuff. It's super cute, but I'm gonna try to layer some necklaces and just see. I've wanted one like this for the longest time. So I'm excited to like actually have one. I just wanna layer some stuff today. So cute. I might have to take my cute necklace off because I don't think it's gonna look good. So, I don't know, like I wanna wear the cute one, but I think that this looks better. So, I'll just tuck that one under my shirt. That's what we'll do and I'll decide later. Put on this lip gloss, the Tower 28 in the shade Coconut and I really like it. I had a brown one underneath earlier and then I wanted a little bit pinker, but this lip gloss, actually I like how it's still moisturizing. It doesn't, it's not sticky. Um, I actually would rate this lip gloss like a 10 probably. At first I was like, I don't know, but now actually after wearing it, I really like it. I'm a little bit excited to switch into my new Prada bag. I got this from Martini Consignment, sorry for the dishwasher, from Martini Consignment um, on Henderson. I made a TikTok about it too. I got a great deal on it and I just really needed a bag that was big enough to hold my vlog camera since I've been vlogging so much and I just feel like I'm always holding things and it's annoying and I just thought that this was like super cute. It is big, which is like, you know, I, I typically like smaller bags. But I think it's perfect, especially for like church and stuff, because I can just throw stuff in here. I don't know. It was just a must have for me. So, keys. This is like always one of the most exciting parts about getting a new bag is like switching my card case. Um, okay, you gotta have the Mario Badescu spray for me in the summer. It's just like such a nice whatever. Even though we're pretending it's already fall and the weather here has been amazing. I'm using dry wipes in here, my Capari. He's like this. Okay. Guys, I got sent this beautiful Chanel like necklace from Eve, Eve Loves Vintage. 
but I just got it tangled in the package and now it's tangled and stuck in my bag. So I'm gonna have to have someone else do it, but it's like literally stuck and I haven't even been able to wear it. But it's so cute and she makes like the cutest story. It's not her fault, um, but I just need to figure it out. So I'm gonna throw in a mask, maybe an extra mask, hand sanitizer. Oh, you know what? Today will be the day that I drop film off because that needs to happen. My lip gloss, the only thing with this bag is that I'm gonna need little mini bags to separate it, but like, guys, do you see how cute this is? I will try to link bags online as well that are like dupes for this one, um, or if I'm the old, I'm like sure this bag is so old, I doubt they make it anymore, but I just love it, it's not heavy, it's really easy to have your arm laid on, like I don't know, I just think it is the best bag ever. This candle, it smells so good. Oh my gosh, Bath & Body Works Pumpkin Pecan Waffles. Do you say pecan or pecan? Also, comment down below your favorite fall candle. Um, I would just love to hear. But anyways, this may not be for everyone. It's a super strong fall scent, but it makes my entire upstairs just smell so good and it brings back such good memories for me growing up. So it just puts me in the best mood. I know there are some people who are too good for Bath & Body Works candles apparently. Like, it used to be the cool thing on YouTube and now it's like not, which I get it. Like, they're kind of tacky looking, blah, 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 whatever. But when it comes to fall candles from Bath & Body Works, like, I, guys, you really just can do no wrong. I mean, or they can just do no wrong. It truly, like, nothing ever beats it. It's amazing. Anyways, I'm just taking you guys through a Monday vlog today. Um, the first half is working. The second half, we're just going to go around. Also, like, now that I'm a Dallas TikToker, um, I need to make TikToks and stuff, too. So, it's been working out really well. Oh, yay! Oh, my gosh. I have another Boys Life set coming today. Yay. I'm recording with the brand... Owners at noon, lol. Okay, I'm literally recording with the girls from Boys Live today, which I'm so excited for. And my mom got me a set for my birthday, and she just said that it's out for delivery today. Also, I have like my Hey Dewey thing, which is a humidifier, which I'm really excited to do. Um, okay, guys, I'm currently setting up to film for the living room. I normally have these set up or filmed in advance, but I really want to kind of do it like with you guys but are those who are on the Patreon. Um, anyways, John was in town, whatever, I need to go up to them and film it today. It's pretty raw with me and stuff, so I really like the feeling of going through like the Bible study with me, which is what we're doing. Oh my gosh. <sighs> so if you guys didn't know, I talk about this all the time on the channel, so I'm sorry, but the living room is my faith-based Patreon. It's where all my faith-based content goes. So if you guys are looking to kind of dive deeper into that or anything like that, check it out. But I'm gonna set this up better. Oh yeah, that's better. Okay, I'm gonna set this up. I'm gonna go ahead and film and then get that posted today. Normally, it's like way in advance and stuff, but um, you know, life happens. Guys, I think my groceries are gonna be here soon. I'm really hungry. Oh, I just finished filming that video. Um, I'm really hungry. I just finished recording with them. It was Tori and Leah. They founded, oh my gosh, they founded Boys Lie. And you guys have probably seen the sets that I've been wearing because I'm just obsessed with them. And they're Boys Lie. I'm putting this lip gloss back on. Um, Q and I are supposed to go get lunch. And then when I come back, I think we're going to do a little, I need to call Sky Blossom and get a reservation for tonight because it has been so difficult. So that's actually what I'm going to do right now. <laughs> guys, I can't get over it. Like this pumpkin pecan waffles candle I didn't order I ordered a bunch of fruit white candles last night and I didn't get one of those and I'm really upset because it's legit the best um candle ever it just makes me so happy so I'm going to really quickly call Sky Blossom and just like hope pray to God that I'm gonna get a reservation because it is so difficult Okay guys, we just got these pizzas. We are at Holy Crust. The fact that you think like Holy Crust, you're like, oh my gosh, it's, what did you say? It's blessed. But like, I don't think they mean Holy Crust in that way. I think they mean like, no, you're right. You're right, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, okay, I'll show you guys the pizzas. They look so bomb. So we both thought we were getting salad on the side, but it's on the pizza, but it's, it's cool. This is a bolognese pizza, guys. So you know me and my bolognese. 
And then I got the garden salad. I don't remember what it's called. And then Q, what did you get? I got Caesar, but I got the chicken bacon alfredo. And your Italian. I never drink soda, but this is like Italian raspberry and vanilla. Soda. It's not cream soda and it's really bomb. I got a like raspberry um, iced tea. So, anyways, it looks really good. I'm gonna eat this now. This is literally Quentin all the time. Thank you so much. I didn't ask for this, by the way. He just wasn't having it. You know, it's probably because I was taking care of our dog, okay? You probably. know? Probably. Wow, that actually feels really nice. It's like a massage. Thanks so much, Q. You're so, you're so focused. Was this really bothering you all day? Well, I just did not it. Is it fine? Is it fine? All better. Voila. So, we are in Quentin's brother's truck, by the way. And that's why we're in a different car. But, oh my gosh. I feel so Texan. It was really bright. Ooh. Guys, wearing a mask when you wear makeup, that sucks. Like, why did I wear makeup, you know? I got a new lip gloss. Isn't this cute? True. True. Oh my gosh. That's Q's thing. Q says true when we first started dating. By the way, I don't know why I felt like that girl definitely thought we were on like a first date because we're both just kind of like tired. Yeah. And like it just, I don't know. But anyways, when I first started dating Q, I realized that Q says true to everything. Like literally everything. It doesn't necessarily make sense, but it's like Q's thing, you know? It just true. makes sense. It does make sense. Alright, um, Knox Henderson Apple. There's a cool bathroom, so like some Oh, we can take some pictures. Quentin is quite the influencer these days, guys. He's He knows his products and stuff really well. So, he really is quite the influencer. Did you take a photo of yourself? Oh, he yeah. took some- I was wondering why you were taking so long. It's because you were taking mirror pictures. Me and this guy. This <laughs> All right, we made it to Knox Henderson because Hugh needs to stop by away. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm about to fall. And Apple. We don't have Apple's open though because it said it was closed online. So we will see. Guys, we got back from lunch. Ooh, I don't like this. Okay, we got back from lunch and I have this huge package from Liquid IV. This is so exciting i mean i almost ran out of my pack so thank god i have more oh my gosh okay there's a watermelon one a guava one and apple pie so these are different flavors and then oh, oh my gosh look i was literally just telling Quentin in the car too how much it's changed my life and then a cute little tote thank you guys so much oh. and then i got this set guys it's so cute i ordered this online because i was like this is the cutest thing i've ever seen maybe i'll even wear it tonight but I was thinking about maybe wearing it on my merch. No, I'll wear it tonight. So this is the top. Just so cute. Okay. Here are the matching bottoms. So I got this from Verge Girl. And I saw it on someone's Instagram. And I was just like, I have to have this. It's so cute. I'll wear my boots too. And I'll just pull my hair up really high. It's super cute. Again, from Verge Girl. I have a few other things from them. And they have like really, really freaking cute stuff online. Back home, I'm honestly like really tired. And I don't... No why, I think I'm gonna lay in bed. I need to grab my laptop because I have a lot of work that I still need to do, but I might just chill in bed for the next like, probably two hours. It's like 4.30 right now and our reservations are at 7.30, so I'll have a while. <sighs> so anyways, I'm gonna grab my stuff. All right guys, it's now 6.40. I changed into my new Verge Girl set that I got today. It is so cute, like I am just obsessed with it. Um, it's definitely not just like your chillest look, but I think it's super fun. They are a little bit like see-through, but it's fine. And I just think it's super fun. It is one of those really loud like sets though, so it's not something that I feel like I can just wear like whenever I want, you know? Just because it's like so obvious and like you remember this, you know what I mean? But it's super cute. 
love this. I think this will be really fun to wear out. I want so many more sets like this. Like, I'm just so into this look. I'm still wearing the same boots. I was gonna wear like strappy heels and stuff, but honestly, it's just like Liz and I are going and I don't know, I didn't really feel like doing that. Had one of my favorite scents burning this afternoon, Marshmallow Fireside. This is actually like my all time favorite scent. It is so good. I have three or four more candles coming today, but I'm really excited. We love Marshmallow Fireside, but the other one in my office, honestly, is like my fave right now, even though it's so strong. It just smells so bomb, and the other one is more potent, like you smell it all upstairs, so. Anyways, all right, I'm uploading a video. Let's see if it's pre-uploaded. Yeah, it's done. Okay, so we have that done. Um, I actually got a lot of editing done today that I didn't even know I had. I'm wearing this bag tonight literally only because I'm bringing my vlog camera, so. You know, you gotta do what you gotta do, people, but loving this outfit, it is seriously just like, oh my god, it's so fun. All right. Hi, pups. Look at Coco. She's getting her staples out on Wednesday, guys. Dogs are eating right now, but I'm so excited. A package from Hey Dewey came, and they have these little portable facial humidifiers, which are supposed to be, like, so good. Oh, my gosh. These are really, really good for your skin. I'm going to put it on my nightstand. I am just pumped. And then I got these supplements, which I'm really excited for. Um, I shared on Instagram and stuff, but I'm actually going off meds right now. So I have shared a lot of my kind of mental health journey on my channel throughout the years, and I realized earlier this year I was diagnosed with PMDD. If you guys don't know what PMDD is, check it out. I bet so many of you guys have it and you don't even know. But basically, the week before, it's like the week before your cycle, you literally like lose your mind. You're, it's just like really intense. So anyways, I originally went on it for that, and I struggle with um, anxiety and depression anyway, so I'm like not new to the meds game. At first I had a great experience with it and I felt a lot better, then I started having really bad breathing problems, and then honestly I switched, I tried out three different meds and over the course of time like I just became like a different person, I was so far removed, I had like just a bad response which is what everyone's always talking about online that I had never even experienced before because I'd always had a good experience. I think meds are actually really 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 important though. And I think that they are so helpful. So I don't want what I say and like how this experience negatively impacted me to like deter you, to like push you away from meds because sometimes that's like really what's needed. And um, meds have made the biggest, most positive impact on my life over the years. But anyway, since I had just been going through that for so long, I was kind of tired of like trying to figure out my meds. And I, I don't know, I wanted to try it a different way. And I've been reading that brain health book. And Dr. Amen is for meds as well, but he wants to try like a bunch of other things before going to meds, which I'm all for, and I hadn't tried these, so I'm going to be trying these. Um, I did an assessment online to like my brain type. I really wanna go and get an actual brain scan with him, but I got the serotonin mood support. So this supports healthy mood and serotonin balance. I got the GABA calming support, calm for the overactive mind, that's great. And then I also got the pro brain biotic. So probiotic support for brain and intestinal health. So I'm going to start taking these and I'll update you guys on my journey. I actually need to put them like in my vitamin organizer and stuff. I'm really excited. So that is that. I'm now doing something very exciting. Moving my eggs to my egg container. This is what you guys have to look forward to in adulthood if you are not an adult yet because things like getting a fridge, getting a new vacuum, um, spending hundreds of dollars, thousands sometimes even on this house stuff, um, and you know, getting a container for your eggs. Oh, sorry. This is what you have to look forward to. This is what excites me. And like, I mean, wow, guys, have you seen how organized my fridge is? Seriously. Let me give you another look. By the way, my groceries came in earlier. Um, I already told you guys everything I got, so I didn't vlog it, but this is what we have going on here. This stuff, oh, I've done it. Why did I put my garbanzo beans up there? I need to move this. A company sent me like stuff for cocktails and I don't even know what to do. Like, what do I make with this, guys? I don't know. I have my booch pop, my kombucha, more booch pop, which I can probably move over there, but I think I have more coming. All that stuff, leftovers. I can like probably throw that stuff away now, but I have stuff for this salad that I'm making probably tomorrow just to have on hand, some yogurt, all of that stuff. It literally 
it feels. Are you feels certain? The, no, I'm, I'm pretty positive. Because remember, we turned this way and then last time I went left and we were wrong and we had to go right. Liz, I'm pretty positive. Liz, doesn't it feel very weird that like this is literally 10 minutes from where we live? Oh, yeah. And like all of a sudden we're in the city? We just really truly live in the best city ever. All my vlogs lately have been even more annoying. Yeah, but. We can, like kind of explore a little bit more. It's like. Yeah, exactly. We realize how cool Dallas actually is. Exactly. So we're going to Sky Blossom. We actually have reservations this time. Thank God. Thank God. Sky Blossom? I don't even know. I think it's like some cuisine. So it's really, this actually looks so bomb. It literally feels like you're in New York though. Know, it's crazy. Right? The most incredible place. What drinks, what was it? Sorry, it's Blue Mermaid. Mermaid. It's a Blue Mermaid. Oh wait, yeah. Right? Yeah. It's good. I don't know what I want yet, but it literally feels like we're like, I cannot believe we're 10 minutes from our house. It is. People always think we're roommates just in real life because we act like we, we live in the same area. We're like, oh my god, we go home. Like, we literally don't live together. Down the street from our house. Yeah, but we live very close, so it's convenient. But I don't know. I think edamame. Edamame. You want edamame? What do you want for your entree? Hmm. Blossom tacos are kind of intriguing. Why am I not seeing that? It's on the other side. That would be why. <laughs> oh yeah, this will look good. <gasps> Spicy tuna tacos. Oh, those look so good. And shrimp tempura. That's what I'm getting. Done. That's what they post in for like the Tuesday deal when we come back next week with the girls. Girls nights. I'm loving these girl this girls be... nights that we've been implementing. They've been very fun. And by that, I mean there's been two. This is right. the second one. <laughs> you know, this thing. This it's tradition that we have. The other night yeah. was so fun though, you know? Yeah, it was. No, we need to have like... Like taco Tuesday, love the taco. Yeah, like, we alternate. What are you thinking? She's like doing a face, so I can't tell. I don't even know if anyone can understand I'm, me. I'm trying to come up with something like cute, like um, like catchy. For oh. No, I'm not good at that. Maybe Quentin can do it. He's I'm not good, good at that. that. Um, who thinks that Liz should start a blog or a YouTube channel? <laughs> <laughs> me. Uh, so. I tried that one. But you can try again. Because you're literally hidden, so no one can even tell at this restaurant that I'm vlogging. Everyone thinks I'm just talking to Liz. <laughs> I mean, like, who knows if I'm actually hidden? But I don't think anyone really can tell. I don't think anyone can tell. But I think I'm going to get the spicy tuna tacos and the shrimp tuna okay, because then. I've got a. I know that does the photo I saw that I was saying, and then it had the Tuesday deal or whatever. Yeah. It looks really good. I really regret not getting this drink, though. Because it's, it's good, I should have just gotten this and you could have tried it and then you could have, you know what I mean? I thought about you getting this one and me getting that yeah. one. Dang it. We, we need to learn that every time we go somewhere, you get something and I, I get something and then we spend. That's what we've been doing. That's mm -hmm. how we found the most beautiful uh, biscuits sure. and gravy in all of Dallas. Dumb. Sad face. <laughs> oh. I seriously could not be more obnoxious at this point in time. We got the shrimp tempura tacos. It is. That is true. What is... What, which one did we get first? Wait. Spicy tuna. Spicy tuna, that's And then you oh, got God. the oh. sky blossom? Sky blossom. Okay, so we got everything, but between the two of us, oh, sorry. Oh, that is really hot. <laughs> Dang. Um, this drink is great. Definitely, oh, if you don't like Tito's, don't get it, but it's really good. Thank you. Um, it's gotten darker, so it's just so pretty. This is gonna be something else. You really can't see right now. Okay, taste test. So unbelievably good. I like that is so good. I cannot oh my god, that was so good. Alright guys, we are heading out. It looks like I'm wearing pajamas. Like, <laughs> it really does, but in like the best way possible, you know? I like about it, it works out. Sky Blossom was a 10 out of 10 experience. We love the city of Dallas. Um, it was really good. Everything about it was incredible. I literally have nothing bad to say. Make a reservation. Make a reservation for sure. For sure. Um, but yeah, it was really good. Anyways, we're walking back to the car. Oh, we also, I wonder how much parking will be this time. I don't know. I don't think it can be that bad. Oh, okay. Oh, getting up. We had to walk up the, getting up into this parking garage is like the biggest pain, but it's fine. Yep.
will be something. I'm back home. I have showered. I've changed into pajamas. I'm about to. Normally, I wouldn't do this, but I'm gonna make some TikToks. I see to edit them, and that's what I'm feeling right now. But normally, I am pretty strict about like getting in bed and having my zen like night routine. But I've already filled another thing of liquid IV, guys. I know I'm being so annoying, but like I have completely stopped drinking coffee and even really matcha because I drink so much water now, and that's made a big difference. And also, it's I think it's just a liquid IV. One of them is also an energy one, but best thing. I'm not obviously this isn't really my vibe this thing but if you guys have good water bottles and stuff and wrecks let me know anyways i'm gonna burn this candle but i filled up my humidifier so basically this is just something that is supposed to really help your skin i tried a new flavor guava and i'm not sure how i feel about it i miss my old flavors so i needed a little usb port i am out of like plugs and stuff and room for outlets basically I get an extension cord so I could plug in more stuff over here. So I ordered that on Amazon just now. Anyways, dinner was so fun. It's just been like, I don't know. It's been so fun just like kind of seeing Dallas a little bit more and going to like the new places and like outdoor dining and all of that stuff. But people have been doing here for like a while, but I just held off for like a few months. Awesome was really cool. But anyways, okay, so you put this here. I'll let you guys know. Apparently it's like a game changer for your skin. Just a humidifier in general. Oh my gosh. I'm excited. Um, this is really not working with my vibe. This candle honestly isn't my color either, but I'm gonna burn this candle in the vlog here because I'm just gonna be on my laptop and reading for the rest of the night and you guys know the drill. But hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. I love you guys so much and I'll talk to you soon.